All right, so good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Whatever time of the day you're watching this, I welcome you. All right, so we're going to look at another tip, another tip in making this online learning platform fun. Right, so what we're going to look at is updating your profile picture from default, or if you have a profile picture that may be deemed inappropriate, how to put a proper profile picture there, right? So I have created a student account just to demonstrate this. So we see here Johnny Doe, right? And watch Johnny Doe picture, right? So you see, I not even see this face because he would have used um, a picture. And this is Nathan Salem from 1B2, I think. I think I labeled it wrong. Yeah, so I, it's a family friend, so I have his permission uh, to use that. And let's say Johnny Doe would have uploaded that picture like that, and you see you're not even seeing the face area. That defeats the whole purpose of having a profile picture, right? And especially in a time where some places, yeah, that going through the COVID pandemic, your teacher have not even seen you in the physical as yet. Right, so at least it would be nice for them to know who they're speaking with and you know have a face to the name. Let's get started. Let's get started. So how we do that? We click on so we can do it multiple ways, right? You click on view profile right here. Or you could have come here, click on profile. Anyway, it comes back to the same thing. Update photo, right? It's gonna ask you to re-enter your password just to make sure that it's you and not nobody trying to, as we might say, mess you up, right? So we click on upload photo. Now we need to fix this photo. Remember we said this is a photo here, right? A good profile picture we just have um, just from the chest area to the top of the head and as much as possible not such a sophisticated background. How do we fix that? We have a lot of free website we can go on to fix that. I love this one. I love this one. Sorry, this one here. Uh, remove.bg, and I'll be giving you some projects. Remember that site, bookmark it, right? So take, for instance, I could have uploaded Nathan's photo, right? And pow! Remember that? What, what's your original? See the background with the fan, with what's here, the door, the chair, and pow! And watch how quick that happened, right? And I could still go to edit and I could have choose to blur the background here yeah? or I could choose even to put in my own little background there now the thing with this site here it doesn't um it doesn't give you the option to to crop the photo you understand and remember we said a good profile picture don't really have below the chest right so you have some other free sites that you can play around with this one is photo scissors, but I'm going to be using clipping magic because as I said, it allows me to crop the photo, right? So I'm going to upload that same photo, right? Pow, pow, pow. The website is going to do its stuff, right? And you see how it removed the background and I'm going to choose the option to crop. Pow, pow, pow. Let's see. And try to make, if you notice, I'm trying to be even. So you see just like a little space between the arms. So I'll come in here. Yeah, try to make the space on both sides even. Come down here a bit like this. Come in a little more. Come in a little more. Come up one. Yeah, I think. I think that is it there. And I'm going to say, um, okay. Right, um, let's see uh, what they have what they have for color adjustment. Again, you know, you, you can't spoil these things. You can always undo any change. Let's see brightness. We're going to make that bright shadow saturation. Let me see. Okay, a little saturation is good. It's bringing out the face better. Let me see if I want to increase the brightness there. Right. Nice. Click on OK. 
right and then that's it i download this photo right and some of the websites you would have to pay if you want the high resolution but we can work with the basic resolution for now and i click on download small preview and it's going to go to my download folder so i can now come back here upload photo go to my download photo pow choose the picture and you see that nice preview already there i click on update I click on OK and you see that nice and again you could always go and make some adjustments if you find um, it, you didn't crop it too well yeah so you see now it's easy for me to realize that that's Nathan I'm speaking with and so on especially if you're a teacher and you have multiple members or students in your class right so students that is how you change your profile picture to a nice professional looking or oh, it hasn't updated yet professional looking profile picture right so you know the usual if you find this video was helpful and thing drop a line in the comments on youtube and say yes so you did well yeah, and of course you can um, make the changes on Edmodo and let me know that you did that. So you have multiple platforms. Thank you and make sure you're subscribing to Chosen One TV. Yeah, you see how much nice help and thing you're getting. Right, so that was how to change your profile picture, um, remove background, crop, and post a nice professional picture. Guys, until next time, I am out.